this your boy Kadega himself, man. I'm my body, and I'm coming here. This your boy Kadega himself, man. Y'all know the, y'all know the vibes, man. If you're new to the channel, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. We're gonna run to 800 subscribers. We at 747. We grinding, we grinding. I hit 700 yesterday, and I'm at 747. I'm dropping videos. I'm triple uploading. I told y'all when November first came, I'm pushing videos out my ass, literally, not to, but. Smash that like button, smash that subscribe button, and turn on the post notifications so you can be aware when I post. But today, we, we don't have no music reaction. We got something different. Lil Rodney, 12 year old. Y'all know who he is. He shot a baby or something like that. It was all over Instagram and stuff like that, but he was sentenced to seven years in jail. So I'm gonna watch like the little court thing, I guess. But that's crazy, like seven years. But that's his parents fault. Why is he shooting it? Never mind. We're just going to react to it, and I'm going to give my honest opinion. I'll fake one of my reactions on my reactions as well. My mans told me to react to it. One of my subscribers told me to react to it. I had, like, four people tell me to react. I was going to react to them. I don't really care. But I'm going to do a reaction to it, so let's get into it. Oh, shit. Now you're 12 years old. All right. So, well, happy birthday. He don't even look like he want to be there. Well, why would he want to be there? That's dumb of me. Just spend it here at a detention facility. Today's his birthday. And Can you imagine going to jail? Like, about to go to jail on your birthday? Couldn't have been me. It's your Spence here, right? Okay. So. Oh. Just to let you know. You know, I, I, don't, I don't put this down, right? I'm not gonna skip nothing. I'm gonna let the full video play through because I don't want to miss anything. So we ain't doing that. We just chilling. You vibing with me? I'm vibing with you. I'm about to make you laugh because if they do some bullshit, I know I'm gonna speak my mind. Let's get back into it. Yes, sir. You remember this one? You taking this picture? Yes, sir. Okay, I keep it here on my bench. Just a reminder. You know, once you put something on the internet, it doesn't come down. And then, all right, so. You were here for, you're on probation for arson. And that is from 2019. And the we've had all kinds of problems most recently. I let you go. I've, you come in and out. I've always let you go because you're so young. I mean, you're 11, you're 11 years old, right? So I didn't want to keep an 11 year old in here. But every time I let you out, you just cut off your electron monitor, you come back. Yes, sir? This time I cut it because I was on the phone with my don't say anything, okay? Don't say that right now. See, why she dick Ryan? Let him talk. Why is she dick Ryan? Like, mine's a business. Ugh. Yeah. Sir. Yeah, yes, ma'am. Yes. So, oh, shit. All right. <laughs> Who called us, sir? So you keep on running away. We keep on getting you back in here. Make you stay a couple days. You promise me you're not going to cut it off. You cried a couple times about coming back here. And then of course you cry because he don't want to be there. Of course you're going to cry. Who wouldn't cry? I would, nah, I ain't crying. I go to jail. I'm, I'm gonna just have to take that charge. I ain't crying. I'm too damn old to be crying. This last time we let you out. Mr. Spence, what was the last time we let him out? Uh, he cut his monitor on 8-14 of this year. <laughs> like, everybody okay, wanna be like so TK. About six weeks ago, cut off his monitor and ran. You know, you promised me. Like snack, no cat, though. Right. So now there is definitely a new charge that was filed. Really back to April. That's the one where you shot the one-year-old? Mr. Spence? Yes, yes, Your Honor. Why the fuck would you shoot a one-year-old, Rodney? Why? Why? What What the fuck did that baby do to you to make you want to shoot? Now I'm kind of agreeing with the judge. You do need to sit a little bit. You, you're doing too much. You're cutting your monitor off. I need to hear something from you, my boy. Because I was taking your side like, damn, why they giving my boy seven years? Like, damn, maybe two years, maybe a year. Seven years, but what the fuck were you doing shooting a baby? My nigga, what are you doing shooting a baby? That baby, that baby's still Google gagging, my nigga. Like, come on, bro. It's not cool. Like a one year old baby. Yes. The fuck? Right, so he's he's an ass whoop. That's for me. He's accused of shooting a baby at 11 years old. And then we bring him back in. He's been out of run. How do you even get your hands on a gun, though? That's the thing. Now I'm talking my shit. I'm sorry, because I feel the type of way. Y'all ain't doing shit, so we're gonna talk our shit. Y'all gonna listen to me talk my shit. But 
And tell me if I'm right or am I wrong in the comments. His parents need their ass whooped for letting him go out. Like, like, is this all, like, come, I don't even know what to say, bro. I'm lost for words. Hey, smoking weed. Yes, sir. And you okay. smoking the pressure? Anything else I'm missing about him? Nope, that's about it. So you burn the shit. You shot a baby. You smoking pressure. And you cut your monitor off? It's not looking too good for you, Papa. All right, Mr. Moore. Hey, look what I found. All right? I know 11-year-olds are supposed to have guns. What the Right, fuck? after they've been accused of shooting a baby. All right, so, so Mr. Moore, what should I do at this point? Where am I at? Oh, I was... See, I, this time I wasn't gonna cut, but like... Don't I, say that, okay? Why does she keep dick on and like let him talk? Mind your business. Mind your business. Mind your don't say that. Mind your business, bitch. Like she blowing my shit. I don't even know who she is. Ugh, like she blowing my shit. No, you're gonna want to talk to your attorney first. Let him talk, bitch. Well, I, was, I don't know, but I was trying to see could you at least give me one more chance and then see if if, if this time I mess up. You should like <laughs> hold me for some months. Yeah, but didn't you say that last no, time? No, no. Oh, you said you that told the me, last you time. You told me you hold you for a year last time if I mess up, didn't you? Oh, you put this up. You you going down, my boy? Yeah, you put yourself in a gym. You said it the last time. So this time, Nate, holding that against you. Yeah, I'm gonna stop pausing. And shut up. I don't but yeah, you told me that I can hold you next time. Give me one more chance. Actually, you said that two two times. Mm. So I remember the last time I said, "Well, that's what you said last time. Why should I? Why should I believe you this time?" All I was trying to do was go to my friend's funeral, and I asked Mr. Spence, and he said no. And then I miss Javi and stuff because I was in here, and every time. Do y'all believe him? Like, how y'all feeling right now? Y'all comment below right now. Do y'all believe? Like, I feel like he need to sit in jail. Like, I feel like he, like, what the fuck? Like, maybe I, you burning shit. That's cool. I mean, it's not cool, but it's like, uh, you cut your monitor off to go to your friend's funeral. Uh, but you shot a fucking one year old, my nigga. Like, you need to get punched in your fucking chest. That's what you need. Like, when I was growing up, my mom whooped my ass. So I knew not to go and shoot no baby or burn shit. Because I knew if I burn shit, I'm going to get a burning ass whooping when I get home. So it's like, come on. But his parents need the ass whoop. Like, that's the type of parent when you, oh, no, Johnny, Johnny's fine. Just let him do Johnny. Like, that little nigga, by the time he turned, like, my age, 18, that little nigga's gonna be a monster. That nigga might try to come kill me from seeing this video. I go to the funeral, and Mike didn't let me go, because I didn't know my friend last night. <laughs> and then, Do y'all believe that? I, I, I just had to, because I didn't want to be more on it. I think Judge understands your point. Why do she keep dick riding? Like, she's blowing my shit. Like, I think that, uh, Judge, I think, I think, honey. No, shut the fuck up. Like, I want all types of wreck with you now. I want all types of wreck with you, bro. Why do you keep dick riding? Like, let him talk. Like, what is wrong with you? I'm mad enough I'm looking at this 10% shit. It's a screen recording. That's not my phone. Because I know y'all probably why he got the screen recording. That's not my, that's not my phone. That's the video. But... She dick riding, like, she dick riding, like, that, she be the type of bitch, they even slapping on her in middle school and shit. Long nose ass. Yeah, so, so, they allowed, they, they want guns at the funeral? Is that where you're trying to go? No, that was, that was a long time after the funeral. He lied like me. I used to get caught up. That, that was a long time ago, man. I wasn't sticking my finger up. I wasn't sticking my middle finger up. Like, that was a long, that was a long time ago. He lying, the nigga lying. He know damn what that picture was like two weeks ago. Alright. So you went to a funeral for a friend, but you don't know the friend's last name? No, because we all go by nicknames. Don't you get a obituary? You still got the obituary, you dumb.
I'm not gonna say it. I'm gonna be quiet. We, we just gonna cut it's just, this type of shit bothers me. It bothers me when I hear stupid shit. It bothers me. I didn't notice and then he said I couldn't go because I didn't know the last name. And that hurt. I miss so many of this. Stop being bad. And your nickname is 30 Shots, right? Yes, sir. I'm not gonna lie. Yes, sir. I mean, you didn't lie already, so I don't think you lying this time would, you know, nigga call himself 30 shots. I don't know. But you're not going to lie. You've lied to me before. Exactly what I just said. I'm just telling all the truth. It ain't nothing about you know, it. I used to say shit like that when my mom about to whoop my ass. Like, I oh, know, Ma. I'm going to tell just nothing but the truth. No, you still getting that ass. <laughs> like, I'm sorry I keep pausing it, but it's like. Uh, like these type of videos, I might start doing videos like this more. Like, if y'all want me to do more videos like this, comment below if I should start doing this and just hold off on the music videos. But y'all know we are reacting to Chris Sells tomorrow. We we gotta react to Chris Sells. Yes, yes. But if y'all want me to start doing videos like this, comment below. Yeah. Ronnie, here's the problem: it's like if you lie to me so many times, how do I know when you're lying, and how do I know when you're telling the truth? True. Because I can just I'm just, uh, all the truth. Now, I'm not going to lie. I'm, I promise to God right here to me. I'm not going to lie to you. Anything you ask me, I'm going to tell you. But remember when you raise your hand, promise to God that you're not going to cut off your monitor? You fucked yourself up, buddy. And that's it. <laughs> I look, you don't want to watch this whole thing. That's it. Why do she keep on dick riding, bro? She's blowing my shit. And I'm looking at the 10%, so I can't really cut her ass because I can't see her face. But she's blowing my shit. Okay, huh? Yo, mind your fucking business, nigga. Mo, she blowing my shit. Word too, bro. Like, blowing my shit. No. Oh shit! I'm, just, I'm tired of like every time. Every time you come in here, you cry. You know that, right? Like, I mean, that's every single time you, know. you come in here, you cried. I would have been. Every single time you beg me for one more chance, because you swear to God, on my mama's name, I'm not gonna cut off the monitor. I'm not gonna run off. Like, every single time. I did like, not right? Yes, and then but look, okay, I'm not even lying. Only God knows, my papa knows, and Mr. Spears knows why. Where's his papa at? Papa, where's papa at? Papa, papa, papa. Oh shit. Hold on. There we go. Yeah, what I can't figure out is why you're always lying to me, and every time you tell me that you're not going to lie. Grandpa, you remember those conversations, right? Quite well, sir. Yes. Every single time. Man, Grandpa bitch, bro. Grandpa bitch. My mom. I would, if that was my grandpa, my grandpa would have been like, nah, nigga, I don't remember that. Like, Grandpa bitch. Grandpa, if you watching this, you a bitch. Yeah, I swear to God. God's got to be angry with you swearing to him so many times. Grandpa want him in jail, that's all. Papa, Papa, why did I Papa, Papa. I'm talking about why you're lying. That's what I'm talking about right now. Right? Like, every time you I mean, here's the thing, right? The first time you came in here, you cried, like you were bawling, right? And you were crying, and I was—I felt sorry for you because you're just this little kid that I was crying. And then now I'm realizing you just cry every single time. I don't think they're fake tears. I think you're really crying. But you cry every time. It's because you're a kid. You're 11 years old. I'm sorry. Now you're 12 years old, right? And so, and that's my problem is I don't like little 11 and 12 year olds here because you're just immature. I mean, you're a baby. So now, but the thing is, Rodney, if you want to be treated, treated like an adult, do adult things, and then you're asking to treat like an adult. So, you I don't know why you cry so much. Right? I mean, you go around pointing guns, and now you're accused of shooting a little kid. And then, I know what's going on. I know what's going on over at Park Mall. I know what's going on out on the street. Like, I know all this. 
Yes, sir. I understand you're just causing problems everywhere you go. Here's the thing, Rodney, right? I'm not going to let you go. Because I know you're going to go out there, you can handle more guns. If the lawyer, I mean, if a judge told you that, like, hey, I ain't going to let you go, which is going to be your first instant. What you doing? I ain't gonna lie, if it was me, I'd have been like, yo, because I ain't coming in there crying. You know, I'm a real gangster ass nigga. Y'all know I'm gangster. I, I'm really with the shit. Like, you feel me? I go to jail. It ain't nothing. You feel me? It ain't, ain't nothing. You feel me? I've been there before. I've been in that county before. I've been it. I've been in that cell before. You feel me? I used to beat on niggas when I was in jail. So it's like, that ain't really nothing to me. You feel me? But if the lawyer, I mean, if the judge told me I couldn't go home, I would have told him to suck my dick straight up. Yo, suck my dick. Take me to the county. You were straight up. That's how I'm coming. That's the type of timing I'm on. Like, you feel me? What type of timing y'all on? Fuck, what you looking at? Tell me what timing you on. Good shot, right? I know you're going to be more videos about Judge King. Because I've seen those two. I made another video about you. Oh, that shit. That was the only video. Right? So, yeah, this on. nigga made a video about the judge. Yeah, you done, bro. You done. I just don't like that that bitch right there that kept dick on. I don't know what's on the case or not. Thanks. I know you're pop out, you're bitch. Your thing and uh, it cause more problems. So here's the thing: you're, you're not as tough as you think you are. Right? You're not as tough. I would have told him, yes, I am. To right? You're not. I mean, you're just causing problems and you're making people pick sides. And the thing is, everyone that's picking a side is losing. They're all losing because they're. You know what? They're picking a side over you. A kid that's just trying to milk the system, right? You're just using everyone else around you, including your grandpa, including Mr. Steve. No, Paul Paul bitch. That's why Paul Paul bitch. At the end of the day, that shit grandson, and it's y'all versus the state. But I understand how the grandfather probably feel because he probably don't listen to his grandfather. He probably do need to go to jail. But at the end of the day, me, if I was a grandfather, I'd be like, nah, I don't remember that. You feel me? Woo -woo. Maybe it's just me because I'm a real ass nigga. You feel me? I'm really like that. I've been in that county before, so that shit don't scare me. It don't. Honey, years don't scare me. I did it. I did it in my sleep, nigga. <sighs> Done, nigga. Fool, tell me. Including me. Oh, you. Son, I'll be capping. I don't have to do you don't think you use your grandpa? I don't use my bubble. Grandpa, <laughs> how many times have you been evicted because of him? Uh, I've been evicted about two times. Two times. Two times. Three, four times. Three, four times. Right? Send that nigga to jail. I'm on Popo's side. Popo, Popo, you a real nigga. No cap. Popo, you are a real nigga. And you got evicted four, three, four times for this little. Send this nigga to jail, bro. Get get the fuck out of my courthouse. That's how I'm coming. Send him to jail. What the f bro, but it starts from the parents. Like what? That's how it usually go. I used to go to school with kids that lived with their grandparents and they was bad as hell. Like they was bad. Like they just was bad. Like they don't listen to their grandparents. I feel like I listen to my grandmother. Like, cause they got more knowledge than your parents. Like, I don't, I don't know, bro. I'm just a different breed. My mom done beat me so much. I, I love you. I love you. He probably you do listen, love him. You don't listen to him. You don't follow his rules. Right. Oh, send that nigga to jail. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Case dismissed. And so he loves you. Papa, so before I even cut them on I was doing everything you asked me, right? Everything. Yes, yes. But Probably for a week. You you did cut the monitor because Wait, the you were laughing. The funeral. Agreed, but that's all over. We're here at this point now. We got to deal. But with that's you. your fault. Why did you let him cut that monitor off? That's the question for me. Why did you let him cut that monitor off? You knowing he gonna get himself in trouble. But he don't probably listen to him, so he probably like, damn, if I do, damn, if I don't, I don't give a fuck. I'm gonna sit here and watch Judge Mathis. <laughs> fuck, who oh, does? What you gotta deal with. And you keep Judge Kim. And man, that's free why Rodney, we are man. who we are now. Free Mark Slim, you Your papa is a wise man. You know, he's here every single time you have a detention hearing. Every single time. It's right? crazy. Because he loves you and cares about you. But you're out there thinking that there's something better than the home that he's providing. Right? You're show him some gratitude. So, anyways, you know, before I used to make a deal saying you get to level 1 and I'll let you out on the monitor again. At this point, I'm detaining you and I'm just going to figure out, we'll see how you do. I'm not going to leave it open ended. You may stay here until you're 19 years old. I haven't decided yet. Oh, right? shit. So, we'll just see. We'll see how it goes. But either way, if you don't behave here, then I know you're not going to behave outside. What you manage to do is get to your behavior level up. I'll release you. And then uh, you go out and you just break the rules again. So, you know, you can only lie to somebody so many times before they stop trusting you. You'll find that with your friends, too. Hmm? 
When I see you again? Oh, you'll see me every five days. I do this when you're under, when you're 11 years old. I, I, I would have said, yo, you know what? Matter of fact, suck my dick. Fuck it. Take me back to the county where I'm taking everybody. Matter of fact, I'm going to tell you how I feel about this at the end because I've been pausing it a lot. But I know y'all, you still watching this video. I'll fuck with you. You're amazing. Let's get back 45 to days just to make sure uh, that we, we stay in communication with each other. Papa, I don't even care. Yeah, it'll be next Monday. Yeah, next Monday. Now he trying. I love you, Rodney. Papa, tell my mama I love you. Papa, I love my mama. All right. Okay. So I'm about to fuck Thank him you. up in that camera. Yes, Thank you, Your Honor. Thank you, Steve. Right, just so show. Turn this over to. Oh, that's the end of that reaction, you feel me? Free little Rodney out that slam, you heard. Free little Rod, man. Free him out the slam, you heard. But if that was me, let me tell you what I would have did. This is what I would have did. I would have said, hey, yo, judge, word to my mother, suck my dick. Suck my dick. Because I don't care. I would have taken him back to that county. I would have probably threw up some gang signs and just walked back to that county. Because you feel me? I went to jail for 20 years, so it's like, that ain't nothing. I could do that again. You can ask any of my friends. I don't know why you looking at me like I'm Catholic. I went to jail for 20 years. I was really in that swim good. I used to do robberies, and for me, I was really out here with the b and were But I changed my life. I became a YouTuber and shit. So that's that's my little story. That's a little story time for you, you feel me? But I really was out here. I was really robbing niggas, bro. Like, yo, if you was getting your car and I came at you, came at you like this, would you, would you give me your car? I know you were right because I intimidated you, right? Saying I'll be trolling. But I'm gonna catch y'all in the next video. Y'all comment below how y'all feel about the seven year old. I mean, not the seven year old, the 12 year old going to jail for seven years. How y'all feel about the video? Do y'all want me to continue doing videos like this? I will continue doing videos like this. Don't forget to smash that like button. Don't forget to smash that subscribe button and that post notification and leave a nice comment. And I'ma catch y'all in the next one. No cat, but I could do that 20 again, so don't get it fucked up. I really was out here robbing niggas, bro. I asked my mom about me, bro. Sign out, but slime gang on no cap in Yo, Canada, come outside. It's Corona outside, dumbass. Bounce, 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 bounce.